Hi, it's Dr. John Perlman here on Real Self just to spend a few minutes with you discussing what I think you should expect during a plastic surgical consultation. First, like most doctors, I want the experience to be informative but also relaxing and comforting for my consultation patients. Everybody's a little bit nervous about undergoing plastic surgery. They are not sure about the outcome. Some are not sure about the safety of the procedure and have concerns over being, quote, put to sleep. So I would advise any person considering plastic surgery to look very carefully at the information that they receive when they visit an office. Do they feel that they're being rushed in and signed up very quickly? And, uh, uh, or, or, or to the contrary, are they establishing a personal relationship that's comforting it gives them a sense of security. Uh, the reputation of a doctor is important, but also your face-to-face -face consultation and, and uh, exposure to a plastic surgeon must give you a sense of reassurance and comfort. His staff should also be uh, comforting for you. During your consultation, I think uh, questions of uh, where the surgery is done, is it an accredited facility, who is going to be putting you to sleep, or what type of anesthesia are you going to be receiving, what are the options available? Do any health problems that you have impact uh, the safety of you being put to sleep or, to the contrary, uh, having an anesthetic uh, just with oral sedation and being awake? So these are questions that uh, are, are very important. When you do come in to see the plastic surgeon, in, in our situation, a patient comes into my office, we discuss their interests, their desires. I also get a full medical history to make sure that there are no important issues. And then even before examining the patient, I usually show them dozens of before and after photographs of other patients who needed what I think is the same procedure. Following that, we go into the exam room and I can really make a recommendation based on an examination and discuss options with the patient. Perhaps uh, there's an option of liposuction or perhaps the other option is a tummy tuck or is it a facelift or just the use of fillers and, and Botox. And these are things that you have to take some time to think about and shouldn't make a hasty decision. And while on that subject, it's also important that you not be pushed into a decision. So the experience should give you comfort and satisfaction that you're in the hands of somebody you can trust who has your best interest in stake. Of course, also check the doctor's board certification. I think one of the most uh, uh, highly recommended board certifications is the American Board of Plastic Surgery, membership in the American Society of Aesthetic Plastic Surgeons. And there are other societies that are uh, uh, good endorsements of a doctor's proper training. So don't rush, make your decision carefully, and make sure that you feel secure and confident so that on the day of your procedure, everybody's a little bit nervous, but that you have a sense of comfort and security that everything's gonna go well. Thank you for listening, and good luck with your procedure. I hope you enjoy the results.